The World Trade Institute (WTI) is an interdisciplinary center at the University of Bern focused on research, education, and policy support in the areas of global economic governance, international economic law, and international economic sustainability. Topic Overview The institute was founded in 1999 as an inter-university center of the University of Bern, the University of Freiburg, and the University of Neuchâtel. Since 2009, the WTI is one of the strategic centers of excellence within the University of Bern, with a global profile in both research and education. The Swiss National Science Foundation SNSF played an important role in the transformation of the WTI into a Swiss University Center of Excellence through the SNSF-funded National Competence Center for Research NCCR on Global Economic Governance. Other NCCR-based centers at the University of Bern include NCCR Planets focused on exoplanet studies, NCCR Climate now the Urshje Center for Climate Change Research, and NCCR RNA and Disease, together with the European University Institute EUI. The WTI organizes the annual World Trade Forum, its research and impact assessments on the negotiation, structure, enforcement, and effects of international economic agreements feature in public policy debates. Notable faculty include Susan Ariel Aronson, Kim Anderson, Manfred Elsig, Joseph Francois, Arantxa Gonzalez, Peter van den Bosche, and Mark Warner. Academics <laughs> 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 Degrees earned at the WTI are awarded by the University of Bern, and are regulated under Swiss law governing higher education. Degree programs include a PhD program offered through the Graduate School of Economic Globalization and Integration, a combined LL.M. and DAS program in international trade and investment law and economics, and MAS program in international trade regulation, Master of International Law and Economics or MILE, and certificate and diploma programs in international law and economics. Alumni work for a mix of public sector organizations, international organizations, diplomatic services, trade and economics ministries, non-governmental organizations, universities, and the private sector, law firms and industry. <laughs> 